What is up, wrestling fans? Welcome to episode number 201 of Smack Talk, presented by SmartOutMoment.com. I am Tony Mango, your host of the panel, and I've got with me Drew White. Yo. Mike Payton. What's poppin' home, Skillets? And Stephen Wago. So on this episode, our main event's gonna be Superstar Scores Chris Jericho. If you're interested in our review for Night of Champions, go back and check out the Night of Champions post-show that we did right after the pay-per-view was done. That's why we're not doing it in the main event for this episode. But we're not going to leave you hanging without a main event. we still got that coming your way a little bit later on. And we've also got the standard other stuff, the hot tags in Part 2, Rest Hold Break in Part 3, Fantasy League at the end of the show, and Part 1, of course, as always, is the kickoff, the wrestling trivia question of the week, otherwise known as the Ask Him. If you don't know what the Ask Him is and you're joining us for the first time, Ask Him is a two-question segment both questions tie in together in some fashion. First one goes to the panel, second one goes to the audience. And before we get into this week's answers and questions and everything else like that, we need to go back and talk about what happened last week. So, last week's question to the panel was, who have had the shortest reigns for the WWE Women's and Divas Championships? And that was Hervina with one day and Jillian Hall with roughly about five minutes. So the question to the audience, name the women who have held the WWE Women's Championship for longer than 295 days. That was the record that uh, Nikki Bella had passed to become the longest reigning Divas Champion. So not the same title lineage, and there are five women who have held that title, uh, the Women's Championship, I should say, for more than that time. Number uh, five on that list was Alundra Blaze at 342 days. Number four was Sensational Sherry at 441. Never would have guessed that, actually. I totally forget that she had such a long title reign. Number three was Trish Stratus, 448. Number two was Rockin' Robin at 502. And number one was Fabulous Moolah at, like, 58,000 days, whatever the fuck that was. Ridiculous amount. So, we need to start getting into who said what in response to that. Christopher Marin says, wow, mentioned twice, Tony, you're killing me. And I said, uh, you know, we're going to mention you again. He says, looking forward to it. So, hey, Chris Marin, you're mentioned again. He also says, the fabulous Moolah twice, Sensational Sherry, Rockin' Robin, Alundra Blaze, and Trish Stratus. So, he gets them all correct. Watchman King says, Moolah, Trish, Blaze, Robin, Wendy, and Sherry. Wendy was not on that list. I think she was pretty close, though. I think she was something around, like, 260 or whatever. Mark Swaby says, didn't Mola hold it for 20 years or something silly like that? The others would be Trish, Sherry, Alindra Blaze, and Rockin' Robin. As someone said, she left with the title. Peter Piccinini says, congratulations on 200 episodes. Mola, Sherry, Rockin' Robin, Blaze, and Trish. Honorable mention, deactivated for over Nikki's reign when it was trashed. And Mono Apex says, holy shit, Nikki Bella is statistically the sixth best diva or women's wrestler in history. Fuck me. I think I'm just going to skip to the rest talk. <laughs> Maybe that will ease my mind. <laughs> Forgot about the rest talk thing that ended up happening. I could use some rest talk right now. Yeah, rest talk will be pretty sweet, right? Mm-hmm. So, let's get into this week's set of questions. And these are about Night of Champions, because that just passed by. I did this with the SummerSlam one, if I remember correctly, about who has the different records and stuff like that. And I figured, let's keep that going. So question to you guys. Who has a perfect 3-0 and o record at Night of Champions? Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan. 2010, 2012, and 2013. Undefeated. Good job, Daniel uh, Bryan. Should have got that. I was at one of those events. <laughs> <laughs> question to the audience now. Which wrestler from this year's event has an 0-2 record at Night of Champions? There are a bunch of people that lost this year that have never wrestled before at Night of Champions and stuff. There are people that have wrestled at Night of Champions in multiple different years and had a whole variety of different records and stuff like that. I'm specifically looking for the person who has had a 0-2 and two record after this year. So if you think you know the answer or you want to just take a random guess, leave a comment below or send a tweet at SmartOutMoment with the hashtag AskHim or leave a comment on SmartOutMoment.com next week. We'll tell you the answer and go through everything you guys said, right or wrong. And we're going to continue on here in part two with the hot tags of the week. A lot of stuff coming in that segment. So stay tuned as Smack Talk. We'll be right back. <laughs> 